What's happening people? Back in the festive kitchen again. It's Christmas review time. We're gonna do a bit of a festive review. I have been to Aldi and I've got a couple of products that we're gonna try today on this fantastic Christmas themed food review. So, we have got, I'm doing a toaster, but it's not a super noodle toaster. Calm down. It is, however, a festive toaster. It's turkey and all the trimmings in a toaster. What? And to go along with that, we've also found in the middle aisle of Aldi, which is a special aisle for the people in the UK that know that, we found some turkey and stuffing hand-cooked crisps, specially selected. So, I'm gonna give them a go as well. So we've got a toaster, and some crisps. So let's have a look at the pack of this toaster. So here we go, it is from Aldi's Eat and Go range. Heat and Go, Eat and Go. So it is new for Christmas and that is a traffic light system, which it's not good reading, but nearly 500 calories, 494 calories for a toaster. Wow. And as you can see there, the price was one pound and 75 pence. Mmm. So, Let's have a look at these ingredients in more detail. So we've got 16% bechamel sauce. What else we got? Butter basted cooked shredded turkey breast, 10%. Chunky cranberry chutney, 10%. 5% cheddar cheese, 6% mozzarella cheese. Concentrated plum juice, beechwood, smoked, streaky bacon, 5%. Allergies, wheat, milk, and that is it. So it says there, uh, apologies for how awkward this is, it's a, it's a toasty pack in it. We've actually got to put it in the oven, look at that. Remove all packaging, cook in the oven for 14 minutes. Not suitable for microwave cooking. Bechamel sauce and grilled cheese topped with white bread. No, bechamel sauce and grilled cheese topped white bread with cooked butter basted turkey, bechamel sauce, pork, sage and onion stuffing, Grated mozzarella, chunky cranberry chutney, and beechwood streaky bacon. Wow. And that is the full nutrition information for, for people that are interested in that. 30.9 grams of protein in here. And that is about it. So as you can see from this, let's open it. So as you can see, the cheese, a bit of stuffing, a bit of rogue stuff in there. The cheese on the sandwich is just like a turkey sandwich. Let's see if we can open it. So it's the turkey, so there's no cheese inside, which is strange to me. The cheese is topped, it's on the top, not on the bottom. So this goes on a baking tray like that in the oven. And 14 minutes, and I think the cheese might melt over it, but it's just gonna be a sandwich really, a cheese topped sandwich. It's not really a toaster. Does it say a toaster? It doesn't, so it just says turkey the trimming. So it is a sandwich, really, isn't it? Oh, well. I'll bring you back in 14 minutes when it's so done. Well, that is now cooking away for 14 minutes. And I do have a little bit of channel news, a little bit of an updated schedule for you all, you guys. I have been trying to research the best time for me to release videos, and I don't think middays, it does tell me on YouTube, I'll show you here, that... Most of my viewers, most of my friends, most of you guys watching are online around 4 p.m. So I am going to start releasing the videos Monday to Friday at 3 p.m. So we have got a new schedule. I'll put the schedule up here now. So the new schedule is on Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday and Friday. The videos will come out at 3 p.m. On Saturday, it's a little bit different and the video will come out at 1 p.m. And on a Sunday, you're going to get double Dino on a Sunday. We're going to release two videos every Sunday up until New Year, next year, at 1 p.m. and 7 p.m. So you're going to get eight videos a week. So time to crank it up a notch. And uh, yeah, <clears throat> thank you all for watching and taking the time out to watch me and just doing this. <laughs> so if you haven't already, hit that subscribe. And uh, if you like it, give it a like. Let me know what you think of these um, sandwiches, these toasties. Or oh, these crisps if you've had them. And I'll think these crisps one pound and... I 
I'll tell you how much crisp I want. The crisps was, oh no, the crisps were 99p. So that's not bad. Big bag of crisps, 99p. Turkey and stuffing hand cooked crisps. So, for those of you interested, ingredients, nutrition. But I'm not too fussy about it. Get into them. Smell nice. Look at them. Nice big fat. Always crisps, they're not filled, are they? But these aren't too bad, to be fair. So we'll go with a crisp first. Plenty, look at them, they're, they're nice and big, these crisps. Proper solid crisps. Mmm. They're not bad. Mmm. These are nice. Definitely worth 99 MP if you like your crisps. Festive crisps. I'm a fan of them. We did try the um, Seabrook brought out a turkey and stuff in one and we got them from B&M the other night and me and the missus just munched it while watching a film. And they just tasted like the old roast chicken crisps. These have got a little bit more flavour. They do still have that vibe because of the turkey, aren't they? But they've got a little bit more flavour. But we're not here for the crisps anyway, that's just an added bonus. And to let you know about the schedule. So, I also want to give a big shout out to a subscriber who created the outro music that you're going to see at the end. Um, Darren Gordon Hill, thank you very much. He sent me this this this, this um, music on Instagram and uh, I've, I've put it at the end now. I've only just got around to being able to convert it and all that sort of stuff because, I'm, like I say, I'm not very tech savvy. But it's here, it's now at the end. The Just Dino outro is from Darren Darren. Gordon Hill and uh, I'm going to link his channel in the description he does music if you're into music this is the guy for you or if you're watching and you're another YouTuber maybe he can create something for you this is a massive shout out massive thanks to Darren Gordon Hill for that and uh, yeah let's get into this toaster but check it out at the end so it is ready here it goes cheese looks nice and melted it's Get it onto there. It's warm, but look at that. So we'll give it a cut open, I think. And that's probably the best thing to do. I think we're going to go across this time in a triangle. take a look inside oh <laughs> look at that the turkey and the trimmings in there wow I am gonna actually so on the bottom it's not there's nothing on the bottom so I'm gonna open one up and just see what we've got in there look at that doesn't look to be too much turkey oh it's burning my hand Little bits of turkey, cranberry sauce, stuffing. I'm gonna let that cool down. And then we'll have a taste. Oh, it is all important taste time. Cue the jingle bells. <laughs> so here we go. It does look really nice to be fair inside there. Look at that. And that melted cheese on top. I just wanna go straight in the middle. Bam, but I'm gonna get cheese all around my mouth. Oh well, you'll live once. Oh. Wow. Wow, that cheese pull. Melted cheese on top of a toaster or on top of a sandwich. Is it for me? Mm. Wow. I 
I did get a comment on the Super Neural Toasty I did last week. And it was, um, it was, why did you cut the crust off, the best bit? Now, the only reason I did that is because of my little cheap toasting machine, the crust don't fit in, so I have to cut one side off. However, however, that crust there, with this cheese on top, the onion on the other and the crust there, I have to say, I think you might be right. That was fantastic, that bite. But the cheese over the top, the, the, the festive sandwich in the middle, Mm. Oh my. This is an absolute winner. Mm. Oh my days. Turkey and the trimmings. Festive heat and go by Aldi. 10 out of 10 for taste. Now value £1.75. I don't know, I feel like if this is Boxing Day and you can do it with the remaining of Christmas dinner, then you probably wouldn't be buying this. But in the run up to Christmas, if you want something nice and easy and a bit festive, this is cracking. So I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna rate the value because it's £1.75, it's quite expensive for a toaster. But when you get all that stuff in there, to buy all that individually, you're gonna have to eat it a lot. You get me so like the cranberry sauce, you've got to buy a jar. You've got to buy a turkey, you've got to buy a turkey or a, a little pack of turkey. Or you've got to buy it all individually. The bacon, you can't just buy a tiny little bit of bacon, butchers maybe. But you know what I'm saying about the, um, you've got to buy all the ingredients and then you're going to have to have it a few times. But Boxing Day, make your own, possibly after, with the leftovers from Christmas dinner. But this, for a heat and eat, heat and go, this is absolutely fantastic. The crisps were nice. I'm now looking forward to the next one. I've got another one from Aldi. But it's not the festive bait because I couldn't find that in my Aldi. So I might have to go to Greg's. Thank you for watching. Don't forget the new schedule and check out this music by Darren Gordon Hill. Link in the description. And I'll catch you tomorrow at 3 p.m. Fantastic. Would be special. Wouldn't buy that again.